9-11, the anniversary of terrorist attack on America. What do you think those attacks have changed USA in past seven years? Obviously, this was the first significant terrorist attack on the mainland of the United States and the first serious attack in the area of the United States since Pearl Harbor in 1941, December 7th. There was tremendous focus in the United States and fear, of course, because unlike Europe where there's been lots of war, that's never happened in the United States in a century and a half. We have put into place cooperative measures with countries around the world against terrorism. What still needs to be done is to develop stronger political measures, economic measures, and social measures to deal with the root causes of terrorism. And this is one thing that we, in, certainly in the Obama campaign, feel is very important for the future. But regardless, again, of whether it's Obama or McCain, there has to be much greater cooperation with Europe, with countries in the Middle East, in South Asia like Pakistan, especially Pakistan, to get to the, the fundamental causes and get rid of the hatred, have more education, again, more jobs, education, jobs, social progress, to try to change the geometry that causes this kind of terrorism. In the United States, um, there are a lot of ceremonies today commemorating September 11th, and uh, we are deeply thankful for the solidarity of people around the world for that. Mr. Gelbard, we heard uh, your opinion about Montenegro and everything that you saw here, and Mr. Baer, what do you think about Montenegro? Well, as Ambassador Gilbert said, we believe that Montenegro has very good potential and possibility, both with political progress as well as economic development, and we would like to do whatever we can to assist in that. In business, you are for a long time. What would you recommend our businessmen here in uh, Montenegro? Well, certainly uh, to be aggressive, to be outward looking, uh, to move quickly. Montenegro uh, is a small country but has lots of possibilities, and the ability to be uh, more out there in the world, in Europe, and as Ambassador Gelbart said again, uh, to identify more with the United States as well as other parts of the world where you can bring in high-end high -end tourism is what really counts. And are you satisfied with the conversation with Montenegrin officials? We think they're doing a great job and we look forward to working with them more. Mr. Baer and Mr. Gelbart, thank you for your time for Atlas Television. I hope we see you soon. Thank you. Hvala. Hvala, mama. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being with Atlas Television. Another business exclusive is on Saturday at 6 p.m. Thank you and stay with our program.